The top NBC or ABC news editor in Manhattan uh, walked out of work, uh, uh, Don Ennis, D-O-N Ennis, on Friday from work and walked back into work this Monday as Don Ennis, D-A-W-N. Oh, I wondered why you were spelling his name. Walked out Don, walked back in Dawn in a little black dress and high heels on Monday. And and announced that uh, she he was she she is splitting from her wife of 17 years to become a woman. Why? And uh, con- oh, and plans to continue to do her job as the editor for ABC News there in Manhattan, uh, the same as she always has. Well, you gotta you gotta ease your coworkers into that, don't you? You can't just show up Monday in a little black dress and high heels, say I'm now Dawn with a W. I'm splitting with my wife. Can you? Don't you gotta? Did you send out an email to everyone? Yeah, what do you want to tease it? You want to uh you, you, you wear you wear your usual man suit and high heels. Right. And then the next day you wear your high heels, man suit, no pants. Maybe a blouse. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know, but just just showing up to work Monday as a wear wearing the hottie outfit, and I doubt he she's that hot. I'd go with Joanne probably. Um, again, just as a courtesy to people because they start to say, Hey Joanne. Because if I named, if I changed my name to Vanessa, and that's what I would go with, people say, "Hey, Joe, Van- oh, sorry, Vanessa, I'm sorry. This is just rude." My 49-year-old father of three, been married for 17 years. It's practically your situation. It'd be as if you all of a wow. sudden decided you're a woman. I gotta imagine that. I mean, because that's a heck of a commitment. You've been oh, married a long only. time. You got yes. three kids. I do. And all of a sudden, you decide, you know what? I'm splitting up with you. Sorry, everybody. I'm a woman. This is not a game of dress up or make believe. It is my affirmation of who I now am, what I must do to be happy, in response to a soul-crushing secret that my wife and I have been dealing with for more than seven years, mostly in secret. So her wife's, his wife, her wife, I'm sorry, uh, has been uh, dealing with, known about it for some time. I don't know when you tell the kids. On Monday, hey, Donna, are you wearing perfume? Oh, yeah, yeah, why? Tuesday, maybe some earrings, <laughs> blush. <laughs> exactly. Hey, baby, he's yeah. into it. After dinner, we really need to talk after we send the kids to bed. Let's go. Turns out I'm a chick after all. <laughs> Mm, pardon me. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Ah, oh, Steve Windsor <clears throat> says, Joe, I found the future. I'm speaking to you from 10 years from now. Both you and Jack have had sex changes. Hi, Jackie, Joanne, and everyone. I love the Oprah segment, the hour on relationship therapy. Yesterday, you gals made Radio Gold. Can't wait for Betty White for the whole hour tomorrow. <laughs> no, she's not dead yet, Jackie. <laughs> That's funny. Jackie is so much better now. She started going to musicals. She's a changed woman. There you go, a little tip of the cap to you, Dominic. God bless Dominic for helping Jackie find his inner woman. And Joanne, your bra straps always show. Is that a thing now? How is your senior LPGA career going? I don't know. What's the point of that email? I don't know. It's just one. You know what's most laughable part about that huh? is that there will be radio in 10 years. Ah, oh, stop it. Huh? Radio is forever. I Jack. hope so. Yeah, well, or not. 